Hey, here we go, man. It's your boy Ben, man, live and direct. And today we making them good old tuna melts, man. Bunch of tuna over here. You feel me? I got the pickle. I got the chopped onion. I got the red pepper. I got the garlic salt. And I got the lemon pepper. Y'all talk about lemon pepper being for the win, man. And I got some sliced jalapenos. And look, man, look. So we're going to get some of this meat, too. Put that on there. Everything going to get situated with due time, y'all. Here we go. Yeah, live and direct. First things first, but before I get too deep into the meats, let me slam these eggs real quick. Get them right. Oh, that's crazy looking. I don't know what that. It looks like it's like a piece of hair on that egg. I just washed them eggs with some water, bro. I don't know where that hair came from, bro. It's just hair in the air. <laughs> but you know what? I'm. I, it's only me and Manny in here, so it got to be one of our here. So can't be that bad. You feel me? Can't be that big of an issue. <laughs> What's up with y'all though, man? What y'all doing? Oh yeah, man, you know, I'm just trying to cut him just down as much as I can, though. Trying to get him situated. The more to cut, the better, the more to mirror. You know what I'm talking about? We coming, we coming real correctly. You feel what I'm saying? You know, I got some good mayo over there, too, but y'all know the good tuna milk always come with the good mayo. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never did this one for y'all. So it's a, it's a whole new meal, man. I know I've been off. I've been off my game, bro. I ain't been pulling up on y'all, but just know I ain't never forgot about y'all, though. You know what I'm saying? So I've been really trying to think of new stuff that I can make. And so, yeah, if y'all got any meal ideas, you know what I'm saying? So, hey, y'all be, be seeing my commissary halls, and uh, y'all know kind of what I be having and what I don't be having. So if y'all got any good ideas out of the stuff that y'all be seeing me having, let me know something, bro. Let me know what I should make, you know what I mean? And then... If it, if, it's, if it sounds plausible and you come with good instructions, you know, you can email me some recipes. Shout out my boy Patrick Haynes. He always emailing me some recipes. Patrick, though, man, I don't, be, I don't be knowing how to really get some of that shit done. But, you know, he he's a good example of tapping in and checking on your boy. He stay checking in. That's my guy. You know what I'm saying? My boy, bro, Morris, always with the fuck with it, too, man. I just want to shout you out, bro, Morris, because I love you, man. That's just how it go. And my, and my other people's Asian, 999, yeah, that's my people's, you feel me? I ain't heard from a few people in a minute, though, but, you know, it's all good, though. I love y'all. It's unconditional, man. For so for so, it's unconditional. With me, I ain't even worried about it. I'm just over here trying to make this happen. Man, I know y'all uh, probably doing good out there, for real. What's been going on? Let me know how y'all feeling. Let me know how y'all feeling, man. A whole bunch of people, look, a whole bunch of people been, you know, saying that I'm coming home. They know I'm going to do good, and I just want to let y'all know that that means a lot to me, man. The fact that y'all know I'm going to do good, like the fact that y'all see something in me, that mean a lot to me, man. I, I was coming up, I ain't really, I always thought I was going to be somebody, but I ain't really never had no proof, you feel me? But, but y'all like, to me, to me, y'all like the proof in the pudding. The fact that y'all see it in me too, that's like the proof right there that I'm about to get out there and do the right thing, man. Stay out the streets and get myself involved in some profitable career, man. Change my life. Cause look, man, the streets got this for you. Somewhere you feel me with hair on your eggs, you know? <laughs> busting it down with the same spoon, you know? making a tuna melt, you know, in a cut though, in a dungeon. And this is what the streets got for boy boys. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, we just trying to upgrade from that, trying to get out that life, upgrade from the streets and get to the uh, environment where you know it's safe. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna walk around with a gun, can have a poodle and some slip on, some sandals or something. You feel me? And a poodle. And be safe. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know, it ain't too many environments like that, especially if you're not wealthy. So that means we got to build the wealth. We got to create some financial freedom and, and find a way to get ourselves in that position. So that's what we headed, that's what we headed towards and we're looking forward. But I know it's doable. I seen, you know, I seen Wallow do it. Y'all know Wallow. I don't know if y'all know about Wallow and Gilly. You know, Wallow did all them years in prison. He got out and he just motivating people, selling shirts and doing speaking engagements and I would love to do some stuff like that though I ain't gonna lie to you I would love to do some stuff like that and you know that's something that he said before that I heard him say like he was talking about how uh, he got a phone now like with that phone it's like this 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 phone is like the key to the world and I, I ain't gonna lie I heard him when he said it and I was like man I feel him because man this phone is the key to the world if you got the phone you can do anything and so it really it really kind of overwhelms me and flamboo like I be a little bamboozled and flabbergasted how people just be out there you know having everything they need to just become you know affluent and, and be somebody in the world and I don't be doing nothing they be like bro what's up with you like what's on your mind what have you been 
thinking about what have you been wasting your time on because man you out there with a whole iphone and youtube university you feel me and you just not having no motion are you not having no money and you can't think of a way to get no money you can't watch nobody and then tell you how to get some money you can't type some stuff in intuitively and you can't see how some other people doing some stuff that you like and getting paid for it and and try that i don't know man it's just it's wide open out here, bro. And like, so when you when you doing time, I guess your mind just works a little different, and you just be like, man, yeah, I'm gonna figure it out because I got to. Like, if I don't, it's it's what they got for me. And I'm gonna tell you right now, if you done did some real calendars, you were late. Ain't nothing worse than being stuck in here, man. Oh right, yeah, y'all see that? Look at that, man. Y'all see that right there? Drop the egg on the tuna, man. Drop the egg on the tuna. Step uno. Cut your eggs up, drop the egg on the tuna, man. Yeah, all right, so let me, let me get this meat log ready real quick, y'all. Let me situate this meat log. How much meat log y'all think I should put in there? I'm probably gonna do half a meat log. We ain't trying to do too much. We don't even got enough bread for too many too many meat logs, you know what I'm saying? We got enough for a little bit, but I don't know about too many of them things. I'm trying to slice in with the, y'all know what this is? Tell me if y'all know what this is for real. Do y'all know what that is? Tell me if y'all know what that is. It ain't even sharp enough to do nothing with the uh, <laughs> bussy. But do y'all know what it was, though? Yeah, if you just said what it was or you commented what it was, good for you. You smart. You sharp as ever. <laughs> I was going to give you prize. I ain't got no prizes to give. But uh, my boy, uh, boy 1400 baby, won $100 rapping with me, though. Oh, mama's, we got a song with me, and he got $100 out of that. You know what I'm saying I pay him for a feature for real. <laughs> 1400 baby, you like that though. You know, he's a real, a real joint. He really got flows though. That's why I did that. You know, I've been working on some music behind the scenes. I told y'all, next thing I drop gonna be a music video. You know, I'm just trying to see how I'm gonna come with it. Yeah, with this, I'm just doing this by hand. Doing this by hand for real. Hold on, y'all, give me a little second. Yeah, doing this by hand, though, but, yeah, so, I might do another little challenge, too, when I do my music video, I might do a challenge, start a beat out there, let y'all have another rap challenge, <clears throat> I'm gonna drop the music video, not on this channel, though, on a different channel, so I'm gonna need y'all to really, when I drop that video, I'm gonna need y'all to really tune in and show love, support my, uh, my, uh, aspirations of having a music career, you feel what I'm saying? I know y'all probably just want to see me cooking for the rest of my life, but I ain't gonna lie, like, I'm kind of stingy with my chef skills, bro, like, I like cooking for me, and, you know, whoever real close to me, I ain't really trying to do, I could teach you how to cook, and then you could sell it in my name or something, we could scale the business like that, it could be big bins, and then I'm just chilling somewhere, and y'all cooking it, because I taught you how type situation, but, you know, pertaining to me, really just be breaking my back chef and everything, man, I don't think that's really, you know, my end game, you feel me, I got other things I'm trying to do, I'm thinking about Starting up with some some mini when I touch down, starting up with some mini mic um, interviews. Like, what type of questions should I ask people though, yo? That's the thing. You know, I be seeing those and they seem cool and everything. Pulling up in the cities, checking out just a day wherever mini mic interviews, hollering at people, getting situated. You know, it's it's just it's just ways to it, man. I want to be like real real wide range, having a little bit of everything for a little bit of everybody. You feel what I'm saying? I don't want to just be stuck and pinpointed. Hold on, I'm gonna put some paper. some tissue paper. Where's some tissue paper? Okay, yeah. You know, I don't want to just be stuck and pinpointed in no one lane. Thank you, man. On uh, everything, so we'll see what happens, though. We're gonna see what happens. But yeah, let me let me get some of this other stuff in here for let's do this pickle now. Now y'all see that? So that's the meat, the eggs, the tuna. That's how that's coming. Bam. Drop a good chunk of this pickle on that thing. Not the whole pickle, but just a good chunk of that pickle on that thing. Let's see. Good chunk of it. Man. You know. We're gonna cut right through that thing. Alright. Give him a good wiggle. Alright, okay, so. Like I was saying though. I don't want to be stuck in one lane, period. I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to have 
bigger future than just one lane. I'm trying to be able to touch everybody hard, touch everybody's soul with this. But look, look, this is going to take a little bit of time. The meat took a little bit of time, too. So, look, y'all, give me one little moment. I'm going to pause, y'all, and then I'm going to pull up when we got the little chilies and the, the well, not the, the jalapenos and the, and the pickles done for. When everything is done with that, I'm going to pull up and we're going to season this together, y'all. All right, hold on a second. Okay, y'all see how I done came through with the little, let me get up close personally, y'all see that, that's the meat, the pickles, the eggs, the tuna, the chili peppers, the jalapenos, okay, so, you got this fake ass mustard, you definitely, you know what I'm saying, don't believe the hype when you go to jail and they tell you it's mustard, because it ain't mustard, it's something like it though, it tastes similar, so, I'm gonna throw that fake ass mustard on it, boy, and one thing for sure, man, before you, uh, Get to because this is one of the meals, man. If you if you dealing with bad ingredients, before you make sure everything fresh, man. Smell your eggs. Make sure your eggs is, is not stale and they good. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Make sure all your meat. You, you know what I'm talking about? Make sure everything is solid because this one of the meals that'll have you in that toilet. And you don't play. I mean, these one of the meals that will have you in that toilet, my boy. If you don't play it correctly, you know what I'm saying. So I'm just saying, like you know, make sure you. Make sure you uh, check the, you know, something about the the freshness and the real organicness of your ingredients. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we pulling up right now with this, like I told you, this fake mustard. It's doing the trick though. It's doing the trick for sure. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, all right, bam, fake mustard always the trick. Then we gonna come with some good mayo. And then we're gonna put all the seasons on top of the sauce. Keep working. It's out. Yeah, you know, man, you gotta guide me on the mail with this. A little more, that's cool. That's cool? A little more. A little more, okay, hold on. All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, man. So that's it. Yeah, look. Okay, put some seasoning first. Hmm? Seasoning first. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, it, like I told you, that red pepper. You know what I'm saying? Good red pepper. Throw him all on there. A little bit of, a little bit of garlic salt. Not much. Like man, he said, you feel me? A little bit of lemon pepper. Not much. You know what I'm saying? This, this very many recipe though. He put me on because I didn't know what to cook, y'all. But he teaching me. That's cool. That's cool. All right, a little bit of lemon pepper. Yeah, so we don't got no black pepper and no salt right now. I gotta go shopping. Cool. You know what I'm saying? But okay, so bam. You know what I mean? Getting going now, you just go mixing. Getting all going in there. Okay, I ain't gonna lie, it smells good though, yo. I need a little bit more mayo. I don't know. My whip game ain't, ain't looking as immaculate as it should be, though, y'all. Y'all see that? It should be whipping more harder than that. Well, let me get my whip right. Well, my hand weak. I ain't been whipping. My hand ain't whipped up like it should be, y'all. I'm tripping. See that a little more mayo, brother? I think a little bit. A little something. Just a little something, hold on. You can probably use the rest of that. Let me see. Mm, nah, like half that. Alright. That's cool. Alright, yeah. You know, just a little bit more mayo. Try to get him in there. How much mayo is you want? I mean, I just wanted to. I you wanted to just taste it. That's cool. You want it to be like drizzling and that shit? It looks solid. I think it looks solid. Oh, I just want to taste it. Oh. Put a little more. Okay. I don't know. Just... Yeah. All right. Yeah, but so that's how we come in, man. Good. Okay, and this is just the first step. So now we're going to get cracking on making a tuna milk because this is the ingredients that go inside of the milk but now i gotta get that grill ready which it ain't even ready i ain't even turned it on yet or or cleaned it off so let me go clean that grill up 
and I'll be back with y'all, and then we're gonna get a real meal. That's the that's the Ben's tuna meal, man. It got a little meat in it too, man. That's how you do the tuna meal. You put some sausage in that tuna meal, man. That's how we. That's how I'm thugging at least. You feel me? From from where I'm from, yeah. I'm talking about yeah. Hold on, yeah. Okay, so here we go with this. Y'all gonna be juice for me right now. <laughs> Velveeta boys, we in the game, man. You know what I'm saying? You know I've been using it already. That's how you know I've been oh, chilling. Good. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make this one for me. I'm gonna make you one right after. Usually I'll make Manny's first, but you know, today, I'm acting weird. <laughs> but look, look at this thing. Big Velveeta boys. I'm gonna try to squeeze him out into a slice. You feel me? Y'all know what's up with your boy Ben, man. Big Velveeta boys. I know y'all. I know y'all remember how I had no Velveeta last time we talked. You know what I'm saying? Actually, I might have. I don't know if I if I had scored on some Velveeta by the time we had talked last time. I really don't remember. No, I didn't have no Velveeta. I do remember now. I had made the. That's when I made the piece of this. Uh, every time I do remember. But look, that's that good Velveeta. We're gonna break off a brick of him for slice. It's how I'm coming. Oh. Oh, he bobbler. Y'all see him? Bam. That's spunky. Good brick. He gonna get real melty too in a second. All right. And then, because I'm just a cheesy type of dude, we coming squeezy on the other side. Man, I'm telling you, my tuna melt is gonna be real melty, yo. Bam. It's, you know, Ben's cheesy thing. That's how you come when you when you Ben, real cheese tastic. The cheesiest, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the cheesiest, you know what I'm saying? You ever knew? You know what I'm Ask about me, man. Do your research on Ben. He's cheesiest ever. Do your research, man. Yeah, go, go do some research, man. You, you'll see it. You'll know about the cheesy dude. All right, so here we go. We got that going. We're going to get him going. Bam. Okay. Not too much. We ain't trying to make it too thick or nothing. We just trying to get a good little layer, good tuna melt. This is, this is enough to make a lot of sandwiches too, y'all. So one good little layer on there. Man. All right, so look at that. Look at that. All right, let me see if we can spread that around. Okay. Bam. Y'all see that, though? All right. And then, that's when you plop him right on top. Squeezing. Okay, you got squeezy right there. And then, let me just talk about what talking about, man. Oh, it's right here. Okay. I'm about to pop open this other mayo and get right jiggy with it because uh, that's how we doing. Let y'all see something real quick. Fresh mayo. Yeah, man, I done made stuff, y'all. I done made stuff. I didn't make a, a commissary video because so much going on. But on every time, I done made stuff, y'all. I got food. That's what I'm telling y'all. You know, hit me with the recommendations. What y'all want to see me cook? Y'all know what I'll be having and what I don't be having. You know what I'm saying? Somebody told me to do this, I think, a long time ago. And whoever came up with this recommendation, you know, earn your props. Comment and be like, I was the one who told you. I'm opinion comment. Everybody gonna know that you the one who told me to do the tuna milk. But Manny tonight told me to do it. But I'm just saying, somebody did tell me to do this a while ago. You feel me? So... I mean, get your props, man. Earn that. You know what I'm saying? You earned it. You been told me about it. All right, we going over here. Uh, I don't know. What What did y'all just see? Uh, a little too much. My goodness. Uh, all right, here we go with this. Okay, yeah. Get that Euphemia on there. That good Euphemia on there, man. I could have just spread it on the bread, but instead, I wanted to get that you feel me on there. Yeah. 
Good just feel me on there, man. <laughs> Look at Manny watching his reels. He lit. <laughs> it's smoky. Yeah, get you good. Oh, right, yeah, get you going. That's how we're going to do that, though. Get that tuna milk going. Bam. Okay. Yeah. Drop some of Manny bread on there. Get him right, too. Pretty sure you put the Matter Daddy on there. Yeah, yeah. Y'all know what a Matter Daddy is, y'all? You heard about the Matter Daddy? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just let me know if y'all heard about the Matter Daddy in the comments, man. And I'll explain it. I'll explain it clearly to you with a, with a swift response. Explain it exactly what we're talking about, because you know everybody don't know about the matter daddy. And uh, I might put the matter daddy on there, but I don't. Yes, sir. But here, let's get Manny going. We're gonna get get his bread cooking up. He want mayo on both his sides. But yeah, look, I'll be right back with y'all. Coming soon. Here we go. Yeah, you feel me? So you gotta get some on that too. Get a little bit on that too. You feel me? I'm gonna flip him in a second. But yeah, you know this. This is just a quick tuna melt. Though. Hold on, I, mean, I, I ain't even realize. I had that water running in the background. You know that water be so. You feel me? Some running so much sometimes. I just be having it on. I don't even be noticing when it's on, y'all. Yeah. But uh, yeah. Let's see what's going. On. Okay, nice and situated. Everything doing what it's supposed to do. Let me look at this real quick. Okay, yes, yeah, it's, it's a little, it's a little cooked up a little bit, but uh, we're gonna wait a second. Throw him on there now. I got this other slice of bread for Manny. You know, Manny like his a little different than I like mine. He just, you know, everybody. And that's the thing, man. When you when you uh when you doing your cooking thing, make sure you know who you're cooking for, man. You don't want to think that you just know everything and everybody likes everything. Nah, man. That's not how it goes, man. That's not cooking. Cooking one-on-one. You know who you're cooking for. You know what I mean? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying, y'all. My bad, though. I'm cleaning clean off, clean off the spoon, y'all. I ain't even just telling you like that. I ain't even, even giving you no warning. I just skedaddled. I had something going on. You feel what I'm saying? But look, it's looking like I'm about to have to flip that bread. And that's why I went to go clean these spoons off. You know what I'm saying? Go get the get the good rinse on, on the spoon. Now we're going to get flipping and flopping. You know what I'm saying? Uh, let me see what he looking like. <laughs> oh, yeah. He getting nice and cooked. Let me flop him up over here. See, you know, hold on a second. This right here is looking like it might need a, a real flippity floppity. What's going on up in here? What you doing? Yeah. Oh, okay. I knew it. A good flippity floppity too. Y'all seen that? That's like a that flip right there was was savage though. Y'all seen it? I know y'all seen that flip I just did with it. We are gonna let him go over there. We're gonna throw him down over here now. Bam. Now we need to uh, get the tops of them things with some more mayo. But y'all seen that though? I know that if you was watching, you seen that flip. That was a. <laughs> A flip though, a real flip though. You ever see? Yeah, man, I do this, man. I I ain't new to this, bro. I'm true to this. You know what I'm saying? Really one of them ones. Really busting and busting and moving. You know what I'm saying? Just, just shucking and jiving, man. You know, like that though. So here we go. We got this. We're going. We're going. We're going to get this going. And you know. Man, he don't really like too much cheese, so with his, I'm gonna just give him a little bit of this fed cheese, a little bit of yellow fed cheese, man, he cool with that. Man, he, man, he rock with that fed cheese heavy, you feel me? That's his, that's his go-to, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna give him some of that, and then it's all gonna be solid. But look here, man, y'all see what I'm doing. I'll be back with y'all in a second, man. Give me a little second, let this cook. I want everything to be situated before, uh, you know, before I get off the video, I want y'all to have a good look at what's really going down and how it's really coming. So give me a second, y'all. Hey, right. yeah, man, so look at Manny. One slice McGee. I'm pretty sure that that sandwich is done, though. Uh, so let me let me just remove him from the area. 
we're going to see what it do, but I'm pretty sure he's ready to go. Let me see real quick, y'all. We're going to flip him. Yeah, nice and prepared. Let me get a little, I'm going to get a little more, a little more time on it real quick on the other side. Let that touch up again a little bit. I'm trying to tell you, though, that's how you do that, though. Y'all see that, though? Did y'all see it, though? It wasn't fully ready. It was close, but like I said, a little bit more time. So here we go with many 10 degrees. Oh, look at him. Bam. On there. Look at him. You don't want to do it too thick? You definitely don't want to do it too thin. <laughs> Man, he's over there with his reels again. I told you he's spunky on them reels, though. But all right. So that's that. You know, season nice and, you know. And what you gonna do with that? And drop him on top. Drop him right on top. He nice and clipped under too. Drop him right on top. Bam. That's how you do that. You see? Try to keep it as clean as possible though, cause you know, that's how we come. But uh Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's ready to he's ready to go though now. Not that I mean. Let's get him going. Bam. All right. Let's see. Real quick. Flip him one more again. Look at him. Nice and cooked. I'm going to chop him down the, so y'all can see what the tournament I'm really supposed to look like. Let me get him chopped up. And with him, I definitely got to like, try to squeeze him down. Like, get, him, get, him a little, get him a little squeezy, though. And squeeze him on down, man. Yeah, man, let, let him know, man. That's how you come in. Yeah. Let me cook a little bit longer before I flip him, but I'm about to flip him in a second. Hold on, y'all. Okay, look, so. Here we go. That's good tuna melt, y'all. Bam. Y'all see it? Good tuna melt. I'm trying to tell you. This is how we come in. Good tuna melt. Good Bendy's tuna man. I'm about to tear this off. I'm gonna make a few more. Y'all know how I'm coming. I just want to let y'all see that. Manny's is almost done. He finna love his too. You know what I'm saying? It might not be as cheesy or as melty, but he gonna love it. That's how he like it. Manny like his like that. That's how he coming. Ain't nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? Okay. All right, so that's it. Good little video. Get your tuna melt game right, man. Get your get your tuna melt game right, man. It's your boy Ben. I just want to slide through and let y'all know something, though, man. Stay free. Stay out the streets, man. Don't nobody love you like your mama do, man. I'm just keeping it buck with you. Oh yeah, yeah, and you know, Frontline is forever. You know, go subscribe to my other channels. I do want to talk about some positive stuff. I will be on Ben Talks Growth. Any day now, you know what I'm saying? So go subscribe to my other channels, go show some love, and put the link to the other video and the other channel right there inside the bio. You know what I'm saying? Um, like I said, the music video coming soon. Everything gonna be situated in, in, in no time, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, bro, I love y'all to death. It's your boy Ben. I'm out of here.